Hey guys, okay, so I'm back and I it is a lot of tutorials, I believe, on how to magnetize the pasties for the babies. Okay, so everything you need, of course, your pacifiers. Um, I actually used a crazy glue on this one and the one that's in Imari's mouth. Um, and I also used the crazy glue to... Um, magnetize Imari's um, magnet in his mouth and also on this passy as well so as you see you got to make sure that the magnets are pulling stronger the side that the magnets pull stronger on that's the side that you want to make sure is uh, showing you want your um, so you're gonna need magnets um, these are all stuck together. This is one big one. Um, I thought, I didn't know it was gonna be that big when I ordered it, but of course they all st stuck to, ouch. Be careful, yes. And if you have kids that want to learn how to do it, please make sure you do it with parental supervision, okay? Because you're gonna need um, a scalpel. Well, I use a scalpel. Some people use scissors. These are very sharp scissors. You can use regular scissors as well, but I prefer the scalpel um, because I can cut directly around the nipple of the pacifier. Okay, so today I got two new pacifiers. Super cute. And I actually was able to just kind of push push the nipple through it so I'm hoping that all I have to do is use Aileen's tacky glue I got two different kinds I got the turbo tacky glue and then I have the original tacky glue and I ordered them both off of Amazon so I'm gonna use the turbo tacky glue for one and then I'm gonna try the original for the other just to see it's about to storm outside so if you hear it rumbling that's what it is uh, okay it's white but I hope it dries clear if not that's fine too And happy Father's Day to all you wonderful fathers out there. I hope you all enjoy your day today. I am literally trying to make this video before I go over to my parents' house for a Father's Day um, dinner. Okay, so that one's off. I just got to cut the lid a little bit on here. Or do I twist it? Okay, so if you don't have... Um, <laughs> wow, okay. Um, geez, <laughs> okay. Well, we'll see how that goes. Okay, so we broke that off. I didn't mean for that to pop out like that, but ta da! <laughs> okay, so for this one. Let me go ahead and separate this magnet if I can. And I want to make sure that it's on the right side facing out. I use my table. Okay. So I'm going to kind of put that around the rim of this pacifier since the nipple is pushed in. So it won't push out. And it's supposed to like dry within. Uh, it's supposed. This is supposed to be turbo tacky glue. Um, it's supposed to dry fifty percent faster. So we shall see. If not, then I guess it will be the crazy glue. Because when I say that crazy glue works so good um, for, okay. I just had to make sure of which side. 
is stronger as far as Probably put a little too much on there, but we will see how this goes. <sighs> I did my hair last night. Oh gosh, <laughs> lots of work. Okay, it's kind of sliding still. Come on. And it also could be the fact that I have it on the nipple that's pushed down because I didn't want to cut the nipple on these. something to hold it <laughs> or do I need to squish it it's still kind of rotating on there so probably should have tried it okay so let me get to the ones let go <sighs> jesus <laughs> those things are strong okay so i'm gonna get to the ones that you would need to cut the nipple off of so i go ahead and cut as close to the bottom as i can Like I said, this is my first time actually experiencing using Aileen's glue. So I'm not sure how good it's going to work on these. But this is the how it looks. Once it's cut off, you want it flat. Okay. And I'm going to try the tacky, original tacky glue. Let me go ahead and pull this off. <laughs> Trying to keep it away from other metal. Okay, let go. Okay, so let's try it on this surface. Did I? Okay. And I try to put it up underneath just a little bit. And if you don't like for the magnet to show you can actually get a piece of cloth material. You can buy some little cloth material or anything and just kind of glue it right over the magnet so it's not really showing, you know, the magnet just sitting there and it should stick just like it would if it was going on the baby's mouth. So as you see, this one is work, it works better on here. This one is actually on top of the nipple that is pushed in. So I think that that's why it's not um, drying and sticking the way that it should. So I would actually have to use um, the crazy glue for that one, wherever I put the, cra the rest of the crazy glue. But um, this one is sliding too, so I think it's gonna need a little time to dry. But if not, you can always go to the crazy glue. <laughs> so um, I think that that worked best for me because when I say it stuck right to the pacifier, um, just like that, it worked perfect. And I was able to 
um, magnetize my baby and also magnetize two of the um, pacifiers with the crazy glue. So I just wanted to give Aileen's tacky glue a try um, to see if it worked, but this is also just a little small quick tutorial to show you the steps of how to magnetize your baby's pacifiers. So hopefully this is helpful. Um, like I said, this is my first time trying Aileen's tacky glue. So, um, if you want to magnetize your pacifiers, if this doesn't work, either, either of these doesn't work for you, the best advice I can give that worked for me, crazy glue. <laughs> and I purchased that crazy glue inside of Publix um, grocery store, and I'm quite sure they have, um crazy glue anywhere so again take one of the passes i love these little pacifiers because the nipple of it is so little it's like almost for a premium size baby and it fits as you guys can see they fit perfectly on the face of the smaller babies and he's like a premium size so it fits perfectly across his mouth and his cheeks and his face <laughs> and then I have his little pacifier clip holder he also has his little baby that I also can put a pacifier on as well so it's a lot of things that you can do for your babies so again I'm going to do it one more time. Time is flying. We're supposed to have a five o'clock dinner. Uh, let's see. Okay. So I'm cutting around the bottom of the nipple. Until it's all the way clear. And I might just stop to the store. I didn't think about it while I was in Walmart because I knew I had the tacky glue here, but I wasn't sure how good it was gonna work or if it was even, you know, something that people use for the pacifiers. Um, I'm just kind of gradually sampling things as I go along and trying different things just to see what works. Okay, so we tried the original tacky glue for the orange pacifier which it looks like it's still trying to dry yeah that's kind of reminds me almost of the regular Elmer's glue <laughs> okay so let me try this one if not I can always clean it off and stop and get the crazy glue oh they dried in a bubble <sighs> Okay, so I'm gonna put this here. Some people are able to put the um, magnet directly over this part. Um, but if I have to go get the crazy glue, most likely that's where I would stick it because it actually holds. Um, you can also try to put like a cloth material up under it because it will stick better and then put um, your magnet in the middle and then cover it afterwards if that works. Hopefully I got the magnet on the right side. I'm trying to press it down just a little bit to see if it helps because this one's supposed to be 50% faster. Dries 50% faster, so we'll see. Oh gosh, this magnet is just flipping out over here. <laughs> Literally flipping. It's flipping back, backwards.
Okay. So I am going to see, let these sit while I'm out, and I'm going to take pictures when I come back to show you guys if it actually stayed and if it actually worked. And if I had to end up getting using the crazy glue to make it stick. So thank you guys for watching. Please stay tuned. I'm going to be working on a lot more things. And I want you guys to continue to be a part of my journey. I love you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you know when I have another video popping up. If you have any ideas or anything you would like to see for me to do, drop it in the comments below. I do have a request for a what's in your diaper bag um, routine. I will get that video recorded and up. I promise just hang in there with me because i have so much coming okay love you guys thank you for the support be blessed stay safe stay safe Ugh, i can't talk <laughs> bye